In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a, a race track for a vehicle to follow. So what we're trying to create is something like this, where I eventually will put like a, a, tr a car that will follow in this path. So um, first off, if you were following along from last time, I'm going to just use that same project that I drew my vehicle in. Uh, but then down here, if you click on that, one of these little boxes, that'll hide that one and show just kind of a blank uh, canvas area that, so I can just focus on the track. So I'm going to go to Plane, and I'm going to press S to scale and just kind of drag it out to about the size of the grid. And then uh, mouse click, and then I'm going to go to Tools, make sure I'm also on Edit Mode, and I'm going to subdivide this. So in my Tools over here, uh, there's a subdivide and I'm going to click on that once and then number of cuts I think I'll take about uh, 60 or so. Um, if you do too many you could end up freezing your computer so you got to be careful about that uh, depending on the computer you're using. So uh, now that I've got that I'm going to press A to deselect make sure over your workspace when you do that. That um, deselects and selects all and I want to look on my straight view. So I'm going to go to view and then I'm just going to go to um, my top view so I can look straight down on it. And I'm going to try and sculpt this little uh, course. So if you press the letter C on your keyboard, that'll give you this circle selection. Um, so use your scroller wheel to make that bigger or smaller. And then when you're ready to start selecting, uh, you're going to go ahead and left mouse click and just kind of start to uh, make your your course in there. If you mess up, uh, you can also use your middle mouse, uh, the scroller wheel, push down on that, and you can also erase, or you can just right mouse click and press A to deselect, and then just try again. So the letter C, get that to about the size you want to be, and then I'm going to go ahead and just kind of make just a random course in here. So first off, I'm just trying to select, loop it together and then right mouse click and then I'll use my middle mouse scroll wheel to tumble a little bit and I'm just gonna grab this arrow and just kind of pull that straight down to get kind of this or I could bring it straight up whatever I was trying to do so I'm gonna kind of go and sink down so while I got that going I'm gonna add a color before I lose that selection <clears throat> so to add some color quickly um, go over to your colors over here click on uh, this uh, materials icon click on the plus and I'm going to go ahead and click New and just choose a color. And then while I have that inner part still selected, click on the plus again and click Assign. So what's going to happen, it's going to assign that secondary color to what I have selected. And that's what I wanted to do before I lost that selection. So now I've got my uh, little course and now I'm ready to play a little bit with um, my my vehicle, but that's uh, essentially how you will make a course. In a